hi and welcome to another instrument choice support video. In this video we will show you how to set up the WS1151 weather station. First of all, insert the batteries in both the indoor and outdoor consoles. When inserted in the indoor console, the LCD elements will light up for about 3 seconds. After that, wait about 3 minutes for the indoor and outdoor console to sync up. Do not touch any buttons while this is happening. First, we will run through the LCD elements. Up the top are the weather forecasting icons. Just under this is where the moon phases and sunrise and sunset times will be displayed. Between the weather forecasting icons is where a weather tendency indicator will be displayed. The next is a pressure graph. This gives the pressure levels from the last 24 hours in three hourly intervals. The middle of the screen displays the indoor and outdoor temperature and the indoor and outdoor humidity. Then, last of all on the bottom of the screen is the time, day and date. The indoor console has five buttons, four along the bottom and one on the top of the device. To enter setup mode, press and hold the set key for three seconds. To toggle to the next parameter, press set. To change the displayed parameter, press the plus button. There are 14 parameters to choose from and they appear in the following sequence. The first is DST, this is to turn daylight savings time on or off. The next is selecting between 12 or 24 hour time display. The next is city selection, see the operation manual for your city's abbreviation. This selection is manual time setting, change hours or minutes. Then you can move on to manually changing the calendar. The next is changing the temperature display unit, choose between Celsius or Fahrenheit. The next four selections are indoor temperature and humidity and outdoor temperature and humidity calibration. The next is changing air pressure display units. Choose between inch in mercury or hectopascals. The last sets are relative pressure settings, pressure threshold settings and storm threshold settings. To exit the setup, you can idle for 10 seconds or press the snooze button on the top of the device. To access alarm mode, press the alarm key once to enter high alarm or twice to enter low alarm mode. Pressing a third time will return you to the home screen. When in the desired alarm setting, press set to navigate between indoor and outdoor temperature and humidity parameters. Then, to change the alarm setting, press the plus button to toggle the value. Press set again to return. And that's how you set up and adjust alarms on the WS1151. We hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.